Today, we call a teacher who hasn't told anyone yet that mm. she secretly started dating a fellow teacher at her oh. school. Ooh. The only person that she thinks knows is her sister, who okay. she's confided about it in. Okay. And the only person her sister has confided in Uh-oh. is me. Oh, no. Oh. So I'm, oh. I'm going to bust her with this information. Oh, no. It's a really secret phone tap right now. Hello? <laughs> Hello, is this Janet? Yes. Who's this? Hi, Janet. This is Steven Sikowski. You, you don't know me, but I'm one of the students in Mr. Simon's class. Oh. <laughs> Sorry, I just had my braces tightened. Okay, no worries, so, Steven. This hurts. <laughs> oh. What can I help you with? So, um, yeah, it's come to my attention that you and Mr. Simon are romantically involved. Ooh. Oh. Is that true? I don't know where you got that information, but that's not appropriate to ask. Yeah, it's teacher. none of your damn business where I got the information, lady. Excuse me? No, excuse me. Young man. Excuse, excuse me. me. No, no. You don't call a teacher and speak that way. I don't even know how you got my phone number. You're, you're so- never going to know. What What is this call about? The reason why I'm calling is because even though Mr. Simon doesn't know it yet, like, he's going to totally be in love with my mom. Oh. <laughs> so pound sand, lady. Steven, Bye-bye. this entire call is inappropriate. Mm. I'd like to know your parents' names right now, and if they're nearby, I would like to speak with them right now. Oh, yeah, you, you'd like to talk to my mom and block, huh? That's your whole strategy. I'm letting you know right now. But guess what? I'm bar- I'm going to be bar mitzvah soon, and I'm going to be a man. <laughs> Steven, Steven, you are far from a man. You are a child. You are speaking with an authority figure. I am your teacher, and I'd like to speak with your mother right now, please. No, you want to make this a love triangle, but I don't think so. Oh. Mr. Simon's not going to be okay. needing your services anymore. Hashtag you know sorry, not sorry. Oh. I am going to Mr. Simon myself. And we are going yeah, to Yeah, you are. This. You're going to say, it's over. Action. And actually, I will take this to the principal. Oh, like I haven't been to the principal's office before? And that's where I had my first kiss. Oh. What did you just say? Yeah, I've kissed a girl. I bet you thought I was a virgin. Oh. Young man, I think you better think about what you're trying to do here. You know what you need to think about? Is I'm a white belt lady. Oh, wow, white belt lady, wow. Yeah, white belt with yellow stripes. Oh, well, now I'm really... Yeah, it means I'm almost full-blown yellow belt. Okay, wow, okay, let me... Oh, I'm so glad I'm nowhere near you, because that's... (laughs) Yeah, you're scared, huh? Steven, I don't know what you're trying to tell me with this whole belt business, but that makes... I'm trying to tell you, one day, you're going to park your car in the school parking lot, and then, whammo. Out from a tree, I'm going to land on your roof like a ninja cat. I'm going to scissor kick the side room here. Oh, boy. Yeah. Young man, do you know how much trouble you're in from making this call? D- no, you're the one that's in trouble. All right. Do you realize what a smoking hot cat she my mom is? Get off the phone. She could have done Playboy if she wanted to, but she, she didn't feel like it. I don't even know where you're getting all this information. Okay. And you know Mr. Okay. Simon is going to hear about this. You're in his class. Wow. He's going to hear about this. How is that going to go for you? Do you know what you just did? You're an adult. You should know better than to bully an innocent child. Bully like an innocent me. child when you're harassing me? You call a teacher and you're harassing me? I'm, I'm only harassing you because your sister Kay told me to. <laughs> what are you talking? How do you know my sister? Yeah, your sister set you up for a prank phone call on the radio. <laughs> what? Biatch. What are you talking about? <laughs> I'm talking about, I'm not really a teenager. My name is Jeff from the radio show Brooke and Jeffrey in the Morning. This is a phone tap, Janet. Oh, my. Kay's the one who set you up. Kay set me up? Yeah. Why? Why? She said that you have a new boyfriend who works at the school, and you weren't sure what people would say if they found out about it. Oh, my gosh. I can't even believe she did this to me. (laughs) You sounded so scared, by the way. Stop it. Please stop that voice. You better watch the trees. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> I'm going to go cowabunga right on top of your Kia. No, with your yellow striped belt? Yeah. It means I'm dangerous. <laughs> yeah, I can tell. You are. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs>